<laughs> Malo hago si dice Jaime. Ay. Pero ponte aquí. No, voy para allá. Well, forget it, mamá. Well, forget it. Hola. Y bienvenidos a Styling Your Lipstick. El pintalabio que tengo puesto para este video es by Huda Beauty and it's called Dirty 30. Should I buy or just spy? This video we're going to focus on luxury because they're going to set the trends for spring 2022. But we're going to find out. I mean, do I like it? Do I hate it? Should we get it? Should I review it? Should I burn it? Should I wear it? Should I rob somebody? Let's get into it. We're going to go straight to Louis Vuitton. I'm not going to lie. I wish I could buy everything at Louis Vuitton. Feast your eyes on this bag. The Micro Speedy Denim Bag Charm. I mean, it's denim, it's Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton is so edgy. So modern, so chic, like so city-like. Like it's like the it girl type of bag, you know? Not bag, like brand. Everything they come out with is just beyond and so innovative. And it's like they're the pioneers of fashion, right? So it's like whatever they come out with, it just looks so freaking good. And this sucker costs $820. I mean, it's not the worst that I've seen from LV. I mean, let's be honest, their bags run from $3,000, $4,000, $5,000. This is a bag I would wear any fucking day. But for that price, I'm gonna spy from far away because there's no way I'm gonna spend that amount of money right now. Do you guys wanna see this? You guys wanna see it? Let me know if you guys want to see this bag because I can review it. I don't know, I mean, I love it. I love it. I will buy this. You know, it's like that type of bag that you can wear every day, right? Like you can wear it every day, everyday life, and then you can go out with it. I mean, it's multifunctional if you ask me. I can go to a bar and have a drink with this, and then I can go to the post office and drop off some mail. For now, I'm gonna be spying, spying, spying away. Okay, since I was already at LV, you guys already know I cannot stop at one thing. I have a hair in my eye. Look at the skirt version. The monogram Jacquois Mini A Skirt. I mean, this looks so hot. This looks so fresh and so cool. Like, I feel like if I was wearing this, I would be like that cool girl walking down the street. I look like a celebrity, but I'm not for now. Type of girl, right? Like this just looks good. It's like whoever wears this is somebody, you know? Well, I guess you gotta be to actually afford this because this costs $2,630. I am going to be spying, spying, spying from afar. Oh my God, this one was a fascinating one. This is by Tom for, and I've never seen undergarments look like this. This is like on a different level. Look at this. Look at the boxer shorts slash briefs that you wear under. I mean, this could be like a bathing suit to be honest with you, but these are boxers for women. Isn't this freaking cool? Like I've never seen something like this. And the minute I saw it, I was like, mama mia, I want. This comes in black. It comes in gray and it comes in white. And to be honest with you, I will get them all. But the boxers itself cost $230. And it comes with a bra top. Isn't this sexy and cute and like girl next door? Like this is just you're so beautiful but let's be honest for 230 dollars i'm not gonna give 230 dollars for undergarments if i'm gonna spend that type of money then i want it to be shown so that i can see it myself everybody needs to see it so i'm just going to be spying for as long as i can because maybe they're gonna say but isn't it so freaking dope next i mean it might not look like spring or there's no indication of spring when you look out your door or window but everything is starting to slowly come in that's coming in for spring. Did I just sound redundant? Look at these Jimmy shoes here. The Bing 100 embellished heels. Now I've seen these and I've seen them in different colors, but I guess they're gonna start coming out with more springy, summery colors. And look at this hot pink one. Do you not picture this on my crusty feet with a tan going on and like some beautiful loose little dress and i'm like strutting my stuff down at south beach about to go to some beautiful bar with a group of like tight-knit friends and we're gonna go maybe to nikki beach or, like a nikki lounge and hear some house music and then the sun is hitting us and it's sunset and it looks so beautiful right next to the beach oh my god but that's sounds so cool. i would totally rock this but to be honest with you i would rock this in new york city as well but I need to go on vacation and come back and wear it because my pasty ass will not look good with a hot pink number. Let me know if you guys want to see this because I'm a shoe whore. These cost $1,095. You're so hot. 
I'm gonna spy for now. I just spoke so much shit about spring coming up and everything is coming out for spring, but a lot of the things in the stores don't come out till literally February and March. Right now, we're kind of in between. So look at this jacket by Montclair. Montclair, I love Montclair. Montclair to me is like the outdoor performance type of aesthetic and brand but with style and function like you have north face north face is to me is very outdoorsy very outdoor performance type of clothing but this montclair is like the stylish version to that and who doesn't love that i mean the fact that you can have winter gear that is stylish gorgeous i would buy this shit in a heartbeat because in new york city i kind of go out of my way to stay warm because i hate being cold even though it's supposed to be good for you good for longevity well fuck that shit because i hate being cold but i hate being really hot too this cost two thousand one hundred and fifty dollars but i'm gonna smile because i don't need it right now you want to buy from me oh my gosh look at this lemon lime slash yellowish number now i know it might look ordinary but it's the fabric and the color that take this to another level it's leather baby this is leather and in this lime green soft but kind of loudish sexy color i mean all right i wouldn't really think a color like this constitutes as sexy but the whole vibe of this this shit is taking me straight to South Beach again. Not to South, but to South Beach sometimes. So. I mean, it has this pin detailed leather blazer, and then you have the leather skirt with the split. Even if you didn't know this was Versace, this clearly screams Versace. Even before I looked at the brand, I automatically thought this was Versace because this is this is their signature color and their look. They're all about like Versace is all about party ass young girl a girl going out there and all about the bright colors that party vibe and did i just describe myself it's so sexy sexy i'm going to be spying on this for as long as i can oh my god there's another one by them i mean they have so many great things versace but look at this dress doesn't it take you straight to spring summer if i can move out the fucking way you can see it right this is the pin detail jersey mini dress. Look how sexy this is. Even the color. I mean, you might look at me and be like, there's no way Daisy's going to like this color. F you, because I would sport this in a heartbeat. Damn Skippy, I would. Look how stunning and sexy this is. This makes me want to go to where? Ibiza. Of Greece and it's like one of those beautiful sexy lounges maybe you're outdoors next to the beach and you're dressed and I would even wear this with the same platforms you see here in green it's stunning combination the colors are just so beautiful modern I love it this cost three thousand four hundred and seventy five dollars suckers I will be spying this shit I'm gonna be spying on this super mad because I should have known better I should have known Versace would be ridiculous in price and that shit pisses me off. I'll be fine, all right? There you have it. Which piece do you want to see? Let me know down below.